Welcome back to Let's Play God of War. I'm Burning Dog Face, and we're here in Tears Vault. That was the word they used. I was the one who called it a bank. Um, yes, uh, Leviathan has decided to come back with me, and... Oh, no. Oh, it's a scarab beetle. Huh. Say about that. Huh. Interesting. Didn't have anything to say about that. Nobody did. I was starting to say. Uh, was that the one with the door with the chest in it? No, that doesn't make any sense. I saw the chest, didn't I? It was back there, I think. It's been a couple days. In fact, this is the first episode I'm filming in, uh... February. Neat. Well, neat is one word for it. Look, I just want to know the truth Oh, now. this, yes. Okay? I don't care if it hurts me or not. I want to learn. Just because you hate being a god doesn't mean I have to. It was in there. I guess I was right the first time, oddly. I'm gonna do one of those, right? There were two of them. Shit! I have just such a bad sense of direction. But, um... Yes, it gave me back the axe because it's several days later and I had to load the game. But, um... No, no, still stuck on the thought of how in the crap is it already February. Still wrapping my head around it not being 2022 anymore. Oh, that doesn't help at all. Why did I do that the first time? Oh, that's it. Is it different? Okay, yes, yes. Just making sure I knew where this was. This is excellent. I don't know why I enjoy... Well, let's not stand here as I do this, for starters. This one upside down, for God's sake. I wonder if it resets to the same timing or if you can make them synchronized. Nice. around the things, not just into the middle of the screen, but I did not see it over here. So as I should do the fire thing, huh? Although before I do that, since I have been throwing the axe around, I do have a very good note about that. Shout out to Scotty Charisma, who says, 
Imagine the surprise Brock must have felt seeing the X just absolute light speed zoom past him towards the Bifrost room. Uh, when I was doing that experiment to uh, see if Leviathan could follow me between worlds. <laughs> I really like that thought, that it takes the portal room every time just like we do. Ah, oh, I should have gone to Helheim. Time here. Ready yourself, boy. Move is uh, slower than theirs, so it could almost make sense. What are those? Oh, those are the chunks of metal. I hear them. Oh, shit, they came down from up here. Ow. Oh, they're those kinds. Shite. Nope. Nicely done. Running at them, and then one of them blows up. Oh, yes, that's why I'm not supposed to do that. I remember now. Hang on. Is it that? No, it isn't. I thought that was one of those uh, Hellfire holders. Oh, right, and presumably this is where we're supposed to be going. More small passages. Oh. Hello. Go. I can't watch, brother. Good luck. Yoink! Hell yeah! Ooh. Ooh! I guess it's an Ethune apple. You've collected three of three Ethune apples needed to increase your maximum health one more time. Hell yeah. So I've been facing out for once. Achievement unlocked! Ethune's Orchard. Fully upgrade your health. Hell yeah. Oh no, I did mess it up. Well, I guess on the plus side, I don't have to go back over there right now. Or, you know, probably ever. I'm just saying. Just hedging my bets. Okay, let's see about this. Well, freezing it down here wouldn't be very useful, so it's not. Ah, what the hell. Maybe I can jump on it. Use it as an elevator. Nope. You hold that. Ah, okay. Uh, I got a sort of rat. Maybe it's the snow making that noise. Snow, the ice. And I thought those saws were scary. Oh, it put the save back there. That's why That's why I was confused. The giant wolves weren't around. Jeez. Look. I thought I was going nuts. Skull and Hati. That's right. The bringers of day and night. Ragnarok begins when they catch the sun and moon. Right? Did Tyr know them? I don't know. Like them well enough to cover a massive wall in his vault with them, though. I have a sense that I'm going to be needing this in a moment. Don't you enjoy it at all? Being a god? On an adventure in some amazing place? This is not Maybe one of those, one uh... must have a little fun. Everything we've seen and done. Maybe it was her gift. Yes, 
this is not one of those circumstances in which I think Kratos would turn to face him. I don't see another trap for the... Uh... Winds of Hell? Maybe we can get up to one of those balconies for a better look. I was wondering about the balconies. Hmm. I mean, this isn't clearly isn't supposed to be like this. Oh, it is rats! It's just that I was hearing them near those traps, and I figured if there's anywhere rats would not be, it's somewhere where heavy machinery is constantly moving forever. Oh, thank you, Wall. That was very generous of you. Oh, I thought we were, that was going to be a handheld. Oh! This wall is about to cave in! I wonder how that will affect the water. Oh, God. What happened here? Focus up. Oh, well, somebody's dumb piece of garbage. Oh! Should have lead with the red one, admittedly. Fine, here's my fire. You're not in a place where you can get away from it. Sorry. I like that one. Light into combo, uh, sorry, light into heavy combos. Bring it. What? I thought you were gonna. No, no, I. Oh. Oh, okay, okay, that's what happened there. Yeah. We returned the favor. I don't think he enjoyed that. One, go away. Two, go away. Alright, that was showing off. I admit it, but it felt really good. I actually felt bad about that one. That guy just showed up and I immediately annihilated him. I don't like the way these Whoa. random bits There's of whatever are, uh... Well, where the hell am I going to get it in ten... Oh. Very clever. Uh, they should have, they have a strong attack, but if we dodge to the side, we should be okay. Yes, I realize that now. I, was starting to say, I don't like the way these little bits of whatever... I keep looking up and thinking, is that a bird? Is that a fish? Is that a dog? What is going on up here? I keep seeing shapes in it, like it's made of clouds or something. I can't even tell what it is. It's like fish scales or something. It's like of all the particles you brushed off your teeth in an entire lifetime, just levitated, that's what it would happen. What of these? Thought is faster than wind. Hmm. Perhaps this isn't about speed at all. Is there someplace else the winds can go? Well, I mean, okay. I feel like the trick here is that there's no way for me to get from here to the place I need to go in ten seconds. So I need to just drop it into that one right there in front of me so I can just repeat the process from the first time. For the record. But I'm going to do it wrong in a moment anyway, to see if there's a line about Atreus that. to me! Because I am curious. I'm in, I'm in. Oh. You know, for someone so loved, Tyr sure was paranoid. Ah, thanks to Odin, with good reason. Climbing and we're climbing and we're climbing. Uh. 
don't know why I did that. I didn't need that. Oh, so I can check every grave in the game except this one. Is that what it is? One that's actually full of gold and riches? Is that a foot or more treasure? I'm trying to see if there's any actual... Oh, there, that's a skull right there. Yeah, there is a dead dude here. Who seems to be on his stomach, buried in gold. And, you know, fairness. Worst ways to be buried. What a weird combination of stuff. I think the liar is Greek. That looks very Nordic. I don't need to be a genius to know where that came from. I wonder what it was even called back then. Was it Nippon yet? Maybe that's from one of the other uh, places. I don't want to be, uh... I don't want to assume. I surely don't recognize the, uh, symbols. <coughs> Now I'll just take these seven pieces of uh, chopped up silver, thanks. Oh, this is rude, hey, Gratos. Yeah, what? Doing it wrong. I want to see if there's a line for when I try to climb the wall. Because I feel like I was supposed to get that, then that one. Yeah, Berserker. Oh, right. I forget sometimes those are one way, or some of those are one way. Yeah, so I just put the emphasis in the wrong part of the sentence. I forget, comma. Sometimes those are one way. No line with that. So here's this. Ah, clever. That one looks cooler anyway. I had another comment about throwing axes, come to think of it. Uh, let me just look at this real quick. Yes, shout out to Clunk279, who says, Speaking of throwing axes in lakes, the developers missed a chance to put in a quest based on the Honest Woodcutter Aesop's Tale. I had to look that one up, I admit it. But, uh, when I did look it up, it sounds like a good fit. But, uh, I don't know about Aesop, but it seems that one originated as a Greek tale, funnily enough. So, uh, Kratos might have actually heard this one. Uh... Oh, fuck it, I'll say this and then do that to finish the video. Uh... Story goes that, uh, just woodcutter, as you do, was just going home from chopping trees one day, and he trips on a stone, and he drops his beloved axe in the river. Or it sinks to the bottom out of sight. And uh, the river is moving way too rapidly for a mere mortal to go down there and get it without being swept away. So he just sits down on a big rock, and he weeps because his uh, axe... You know, he's a poor man. He's a woodcutter. That axe is the only way he can uh, sustain himself. The only way he can, you know, earn a living. The Greek god Hermes happens by, asks the man why he's crying. And he explains, you know, he dropped his axe in. It's the only way I can buy food and such. And, the, and Hermes is so moved by this that he says, I'll tell you what, I'll get the axe back for you. So he dives into the river. And a moment later, he comes back up. With a, with a beautiful axe made of solid gold. It would be totally useless for chopping trees, but it's priceless. This man would be insanely wealthy if he sold this. And Hermes says, I found this down there. Is this your axe? But the woodcutter just shakes his head sadly and goes, No, that's not mine. And Hermes goes, okay, and he goes back into the river. And he comes back out with an axe wrought entirely, handle and all, from silver. It's not as ornate as the first one, you know, the carvings are a little less complicated. 
but it's still beautiful. It would fetch at a very good price. You know, it would, uh, at least let him move into a bigger house or buy more axes or something. But no, the woodcutter says that's not mine either. And it isn't until he goes down a third time and Hermes comes back with the man's humble original axe that he says, yes, that axe belongs to me. And Hermes says that this whole... Th you know, and Hermes says, I am so moved, you know, by your uh, honesty and your, you know, ability to turn down, you know, this windfall that I'm going to give all three of these axes to you. And overjoyed, the man thanks him profusely and goes home. He tells his neighbor about it, and his neighbor, greedy, thinks, My god, I could become just as wealthy as him if I did this. So he takes his own axe. And he goes down for the woods and tosses it in the river and pretends to cry. And what do you know? Hermes appears, and the whole thing plays itself out again. Except this time, as soon as he comes up with a golden axe, he tells Hermes, Yes, that is the axe that I dropped. And Hermes just makes a face and says, This was a test. And you failed. He's so disgusted with the man's greed that he just leaves and doesn't give him any axes back, not even the original one he tossed in there. So yeah, honesty is the best policy. Except now I've been running in circles and I need to remind myself which way I'm going and... Okay, yes, right, that was a very good first shot. <laughs> missed. Take that! I'm Burning Dog Face. And I will see you on the next episode of Let's Play God of War. I might not be able to uh, enthrall you with any more stories. Sorry, I just trailed off there because I suddenly realized that um, in this particular universe, Hermes is in no position to uh, give anyone their axes back. But, you know, I'm sure they could rework that into a Norse way. Apparently, in addition to the Honest Woodcutter, it's also popularly known as uh, Mercury and the, uh, you know, and the Lumberjack, thanks to uh, the Roman name for Hermes. But yes, yes, there are other ways you could do that. <clears throat> I'll see you on the next episode, Burning Dog fans. Later.